Hi again, Peggy and Tony. I am here at 5085 Valley Crest Drive, Unit 275. So this is the same complex, uh, Valley Terrace, um, just on the other side of the complex. Um, right across there is uh, Clayton Road. Um, so there is a good amount of traffic that's gonna flow through there. Can't hear it inside though, but uh, you can on the outside. The patio is actually right in this area. Again, I, I talk fast in these videos, so feel free to pause um, to view all angles. Um, I give you a little orientation on the first uh, video on uh, just how to navigate and look around. Um, but here we are inside. Uh, now this one is a little bit larger, um, and it looks and feels like it's in the closet and storage area. So this one is two bedrooms, two baths. Uh, 1,160 square feet, so 20 square feet larger, and it's reflected in the price. This is uh, 399,000. The other one just went pending, was only on the market for four days, so it went pretty quick. Um, this one has been on the market uh, for 20 days. So um, I don't see that much difference outside of the price and the additional square footage, um, but uh, We'll go ahead and take a look and you'll see there's uh, more closet space. So um, again, somewhat of a um, smaller living area, uh, this combo living and family room here in the front. And then you have the dining area and then the kitchen here. Um, this one does not come with um, the appliances or I'm sorry, uh, let me be more specific. This one does not have a refrigerator included as well as the washer and dryer, um, which is also in unit. So um, you will need a refrigerator and a washer and dryer uh, for this unit. Okay, so uh, again, similar upgrades. This is um, a laminate wood looking uh, flooring and then a new countertops. Uh, this looks like granite and then backsplash, so uh, a similar feel. Again, grays and whites, etc. It is a little bit darker here in this unit as well. Could be the time of the day in the sun, but um, just pointing that out. Uh, and then here we have the first closet, which is, again, pretty big. Probably need a organization system on the walls. There's closet number two. This could even be a pantry. Okay, so the other unit did not have both of these out here um, as far as the closets, the main big closets. And then here is a coat closet right off the front door. Okay, so again, just to recap, um, on the first floor, hard surfaces, in unit, washer and dryer. Um, what's interesting is they didn't upgrade here this little entry, uh, entry hallway, so... Um, not sure how particular you are about it, but the rest of the floors have been updated. Okay, so this is just a um, furnace and then water heater. And then now we'll go to the rooms. So no carpet in these rooms. The other one had carpet. This is all hard surface flooring, so this is probably better. So bedroom number one. And then master bedroom. So bedroom number two. And then lots of storage here. So you got this big closet right off of the bedroom. And then a double closet right here to the master bathroom. So a little vanity, nice uh, and updated. And then here's bathroom number one. They did upgrade this bathroom, or sorry, shower stall. So, um, a lot of positives and negatives when you're comparing the two units. I would say this one has a more complete upgrade with, with the exception of that entryway. But um, here we have where the washer and dryer would go and the hookups are right here. More storage for linens. More storage here. This one just has a lot more storage. And then bathroom number two, so this would be the guest. Um, we get a finished bathroom, so that's good. And our shower stall's been upgraded. Only thing that needs to be upgraded is that fan. Pretty old. 
All right. And then lastly, we'll go outside to the patio. I think this patio is a little bit smaller than the last one, but it's still much larger than anything we saw on Monday. So here we go. They got a little raised bed garden here. We'd have to look in to see. I didn't. I haven't seen any barbecues outside, but um, have to check with the HOA if that's allowed. Well, plenty of space to have a barbecue. All right, so this one is, um, you know, I think this is on par to the one that we saw on the lower level uh, that was um, a little dark, uh, had upgrades. It just didn't have the in-unit laundry. I think that was on uh, on Clayton. Um, so this could be, I think this is on par with that, uh, probably a little bit better uh, considering you know, the in-unit laundry. Uh, okay, so I will send this to you and then uh, let me know what you think. Thanks, Peggy. Thanks, Tony. Bye.